Okay, for many of us, getting holiday ready, right? Yeah. Means a new outfit, maybe yeah. a trip to your favorite stylist, maybe both, maybe all of the above. But one local company is taking self-care a step further. Brenda Merzieski, the owner of Mids Mitzi Cosmetics. I'm so excited to see you. I'm so excited. It's so to good to see you. you. I get to see you again. <laughs> yep. Joins us along with uh, Liza Cook from Prolenium mm -hmm. and PA Luann Hespler to explain how. Ladies, first of all, you all look amazing. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you, you so much for being with us. Too. Well, it's good to be here. <laughs> Tell us, Brenda, first of all, how the whole company got started because I think it's an amazing story. So really quickly, Mitzi got started um, out of necessity for my child, Brady, who you actually met. Yep. Um, he had open heart surgery. Yep. At, at were, what age? Uh, six months old. Six yeah, months old. Um, so they were using petroleum on his mouth during that time and I found out that petroleum being so close to your mouth Mouth, you're going to swallow that over a period of time. You could swallow about 10 pounds in your lifetime. Oh my oh my goodness gracious. Your body doesn't metabolize that. Right. So being a cosmetic chemist, I wanted to do something about that and go like the all natural mm -hmm. way, organic way, safe, sustainable. And eight years later, eight years, two days ago, uh, we celebrated our anniversary at Mitzi Cosmetics and now Mitzi Labs and Mitzi RX. So we're three companies now. That's that is fantastic. incredible. And you moved from Berlin to Middletown. We moved from Portland, Portland. to Middletown. Oh, Portland yes. to Middletown. Yes. Because I remember going to the facility in I Portland. remember too. You were like making stuff with me. Yeah, I was. We were doing everything. the thing and the cake. I felt like I was cooking something. Yes, it but was we were wonderful. Making... So much fun. That's awesome. Okay, so you ladies have an event to get everybody holiday ready and there's maybe in the past have been a little bit of a stigma with Yes. Um, different types of procedures that women have done, but that's changing, right? Yes, that's the, changing. The a attitudes lot. have changed a lot over the last several years. So, talk to us about that. Like, why have things changed? Are women more comfortable talking about it? I feel like women are definitely more comfortable talking about it. And us being in the industries that we're mm -hmm. in, we we complement like what our industries do together and that's mm -hmm. why we're here today and we want to just kind of demystify the taboo around a lip filler or you know facial fillers and injections and um, just talk about like the safety about it. Yeah, mm -hmm. filler has come a long way. I think the stigma is going by the wayside. We're looking for over years it's changed. I, I've developed a more signature style of a soft and subtle facial rejuvenation which okay. I think gives us a subtlety Lips don't have to look like ducks. We don't have to look plastic, but mm -hmm. we can be rejuvenated and refreshed, and it makes us feel better when we look better. Mm -hmm. And Liza's product, I think, has really changed the industry. It's changed my style. Tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, so I was going to say there's also an increased awareness on aging beautifully because we mm -hmm. can see celebrities on TV sure. that just don't seem to age, and right. a lot of that has to do with medical cause, um, aesthetics. You think Brad Pitt's had cosmetic surgery? He looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> I think a lot of people have had. I think a lot, I think a lot, a lot of people, of people have had. Right? But there's still a lot of unknown and we get questions from patients um, wanting more information. Mm -hmm. So I think it's important to show some results and um, talk about this new science. Okay, so what can we talk about some of the science? Yes. Yeah. Please. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, lip filler has changed. I'm currently launching a new product here in the U.S. and we have um, older fillers that are a 20-year-old science and this one is actually brand new that has some advantages with safety, longevity, less swelling, less pain, and less downtime. Um, I find in Connecticut the patients here really want a nice natural subtle result mm -hmm. and that's what this new type of gel is able to give them. Fantastic. Well, ladies we're out of time but unfortunately it, uh, we could talk to you forever because I, I find we this. Can totally talk we could totally talk to you forever. <laughs> really quickly though let's get let's talk about um, the event and the grand opening just to get that out very yeah, quickly. So Mitzi's grand opening is Saturday November 27th mm -hmm. and we're gonna be open from 10 to 1 and it's open to everybody Terrific. so that they can tour the building and see us and shop for the holidays. And that's, awesome. the, that's the weekend of how things that Giving. Small Business Saturday and right after Black Friday. Excellent. Fantastic. Yeah. Ladies, we can't thank you enough for being with us. Thank you. Thanks, again, you keep guys. it up. You look terrific. I know. Thank you. <laughs> All right, some of that self care needs to be applied to your favorite beauty tool.